Hey guys, Tomboy601, and welcome to Update Day. Right now we're out in the Colorado in the Popeye uh, camo. Uh, we'll go ahead and go over everything you need to know about this update, all of the new and fun toys. Uh, we'll basically just go tab by tabs in the menu. First things first, fleets have arrived. That is right, they are finally here. You can go ahead, uh, look for fleets to join. You can uh, see if you've, you've been invited to any. There are many a fleet out there right now. Uh, we won't be making one for this channel, uh, in all honesty. I think they are making a, a, uh, a fleet for the CCs who don't want don't want to have to deal with community uh, you know management and fleet stuff. And I think that's where I'm going to be. I think as someone who's just a chill player, don't need the added uh, pressures of, of doing the fleet stuff. Don't worry. I'm not like hipper. I saw his video today. Um, so yeah, no, no sweatiness over here beyond that. If we head on over to the play tab, of course, brawl is going on. Um, there are a couple of rewards for, uh, going on. There's not, it's not about up. Uh, it's not about percentile anymore. It's just about total number of wins or actually that's normally brawls, but uh, you're looking at a total of 60 wins to get through the whole Brawl season. Of course, Brawl going on this entire update. So uh, have fun if you want to go over into Brawl. Other than that, this is pretty much the uh, the good old American Cruiser update. So, uh, of course, we do have three new American Cruisers. The first of which is San Diego. Um, she's in Atlanta class uh, with SAP. She's been She's been interesting so far. We have Salem, who is now in the Forge. Uh, she is basically a down-tiered Des Moines. Basically a little bit less health. No sonar, a forced DFAA, but she gets a super heal. So, uh, yeah. Is it going to be worth it? I don't know. Uh, is, is it worth 25,000 steel? Eh, we'll see. Tulsa is the other boat that's new for this update. Tulsa is the campaign boat. So far, I have been enjoying her. I think she's pretty accurate for what she is uh fairly good rate of fire i think i think she, she's like middle of the road to a decent cruiser um kind of just what you would expect out of the american boats and those are the brand new ships of the update uh as far as campaigns and missions goes there is one set of assignments called the fistful of impendium impendium is the brand new uh event currency going on for this in, for the for the length of this update uh, basically play american boats whenever you can to get these rewards you'll be able to spend the impendium over in the uh in the watch call it in in the special tab of the store there's also impendium available in the uh in the campaign no new bureau project sadly but the store the store is kind of where it's at first off there is uh coupons for 25 percent off uh, American boats, which hey, if you if you were maybe looking at con con uh, constellation, eh, might be a decent time to pick up constellation uh, doubloons. Nothing really. The special store is where we want to take a look. And uh, well, let's let's talk about this first off. Uh, <laughs> San Diego is in the random bundles. Um. Guys, be careful, because if you want to purchase 100 tiers, i.e. if you want to buy all of the sets out, it's 75,000 doubloons. I don't, I don't, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just let you guys in on a little secret here. San Diego, not worth 75,000 doubloons. If you see it early on, if you see it like, you log in and it's right there, you know, definitely worth 750 doubloons, but, uh, uh, be careful with this one. The other thing you can spend in Pentium on is those red, white, and blue, uh, red, white, and blue camos for a bunch of the boats. This is probably where I'm going to spend a lot of my in Pentium because I do like those camos. Uh, beyond that, we do have Popeye and Bluto both available for, uh, the Impendium, the special camo that we're currently, the special camo we're currently rocking, 
The other one is Semper Fortis Crate. The Semper Fortis Crate is how you're going to do the collections for the Americans. Uh, basically, 8% chance of dropping one of of each of each of the requirements for the collection. Kind of up to you if you think uh, it's really worth it to go get the uh, Lady Liberty guys. I'm not a big guys person, so it doesn't really uh, strike out to me as something that may be really worth it. And then we have Insignia Promotion Ores. Uh, accommodation, big summer crate, and then your regular boosters. Beyond that, the other interesting thing that is in the store is, of course, the Forge. So we can see Salem is now 25,000 steel. Uh, Missouri is 17,500. And if you are interested in upgrading a uh, module into its legendary or whatever form, basically you would come into the tabs in the ship tab, and then you can upgrade from there, whether you want it to be an epic or a legendary mod. Of course, leg legendary mod adds that 5% damage uh, to, to uh, for each kill. So uh, <laughs> very interesting times. And guys, that's pretty much everything of the update. Uh, it's it's a big one. I know it doesn't seem like it, but uh, I think the, the legendary mods is going to be just a little crazy. Anyways, guys, if you liked the video, hit the like button, hit subscribe button, and I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day. See ya.